you know, it's been crazy. I ain't had no days off. Um, no, no, no such thing as days off. I be logging. Oh, it's days off. All right. It's not this week. That check looking lovely. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Go look at the description. Lovely. See if you, see if you will be interested. Very busy. I'm, I'm so delirious. I don't know what's going on. Me neither. <laughs> I don't know what day it is. <laughs> I was laughing at words. Today, I was like, why does word look so funny? <laughs> Out of Y'all ever word. seen, um, t- y'all ever seen the word telef- telephony? Yeah. Yeah. Telephony. Yeah. It looks so funny. I always call it telephony. Yes. <laughs> That's what I was telephony. saying. I was like, is it telephony? I don't think it's telephony, <laughs> but it looks funny. Telephony. That don't sound right. <laughs> but that's how it's spelled. But why is it spelled like that? Who came up with that? The te- telephony system. I'm gonna just say the telephone system. Right. White people. The why don't make it fancy, the why make it funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is it a fake telephone system? Telephony? Hey, it might be. It's, it's ran by computers. <laughs> Man. Oh yeah. I am, but listen. I, went, I, I got home probably like seven this morning. Bro, by eight o'clock this morning, I was like, I was sitting on the couch watching TV and then I just like I don't know, I just like blinked out. <laughs> and I, <laughs> I came to it. I didn't know like it was daytime or nighttime. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, oh, SpongeBob, me. Yeah, like, but and it, you know, when the man came, I always had the blinds closed, so I don't. It just it always looks the same, so I just be like, "What? Is everybody sleep? Like, what's going on? Like, what's going on in my house?" Yeah, it's bad. It's like having an inside room in a cruise. Yeah. Yeah. And that's how work is. That's how work is too. So, oh, they ain't got no windows or nothing. Nah. Just, uh, once, once, you, once we go in, we just all everything looks the same. A big warehouse, <laughs> warehouse, and and um, those neon, not neon lights, but fluorescent neon lights. Neon vests. No neon vests. <laughs> that's what they it got is. No clocks. They don't got no clocks anyway, do they? No, nah, they got clocks. They got a bunch of clocks. Oh. You got the little clocks where you lock that you like, um, you know, punch in and out on, and they got big, they still get they still use those. Was, wasn't those used back in the 40s? Hey, company still, you still like, got to clock in. Well, yeah, we just we got badges, we just walk, yeah, you just walk by with your badge and hit it on the thing. Oh, I'm yeah. gonna say Fred Flintstone was no, not the. <laughs> <laughs> not the time card. <laughs> Stamp it in there, put it in the little thing on the wall. No, not those. I remember I had that at um, UPS 20 oh, some years ago. That's it. Ching, ching. Well, I don't remember how I kept <laughs> my hours at Chuck E. Cheese. I don't know if. Uh, the end or not. On, on the, the computer? computer? Yeah, on the computer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's what it was. Yeah, we make our people clock mm-hmm. in on the phone. They got to put in a four-digit code. Say log in, four-digit code. Oh, y'all just go by the phone? Mm-hmm. Yeah, people, used to, people used to clock in on the computer and then wait like five minutes and clock in on the phone. <laughs> Try mm-hmm. to get five minutes. <laughs> No, nah, buddy, you get paid when you start working. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Work sucks, though. But, yo, <laughs> what they do, what they do. It's your boy Joe, man, who back again. You know what it is, man? You look like a podcast. We in this thing. We here. Season two, episode 20. You know what I'm saying? Tick, ticking right along. Yes, sir. Episode 20. Make sure y'all like, share, subscribe. 
Hit your bell, drop a comment. You know what I mean? All that good stuff. Shout out to the lookers, man. How many we got until 100? Um, this is episode 72. Oh, geez. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to make it, though. Yeah. We, we, we're we're gonna out. make it. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, we are. Cut to cut to video. Oh, <laughs> every, look, every time somebody say we're gonna make it, cut to video. <laughs> I'm, I'm finding. I'm gonna find that video right now. <laughs> and I'm cutting it onto the party. <laughs> That's funny. That is hilarious. What's going on, Diz? What's up, man? Man, you see it trying to stay, stay up and alert. I know, right? <laughs> we talked about work earlier. It's, it ain't no joke, man. It sucks. Somebody got to do it. Yeah, definitely got it. Definitely got to get to it. I ain't trying to. I it. just, I just don't understand how people be like. I sleep when I die. Yeah. Um, those, people say that, those people that say that are dumb. I want to say no good. Well, they pass out. They be passed out. <laughs> people, <laughs> talk about if you're sleeping, you you ain't making money. Find a job that you don't have to make. You don't have to be awake to make money. Awake to make money. <laughs> Millionaire sleep. Millionaires sleep peacefully at night. Wealthy people sleep peacefully at night. You know why? Because their money is making money. It's these wannabe rich people, hustlers that out there, oh, I got to be up to do this. Like, look. It sounds good. When you're awake, everybody else that you're hustling, that you're trying to make money from is sleep. (laughs) (laughs) So what are you really doing? Yeah. If you're the only one up, what are you really doing? <laughs> Nobody trying to get their credit fixed at three o'clock in the morning. Exactly. <laughs> Nobody trying Take to your ass to sleep. Nobody's trying and to make, make nutritional smoothies. Look. <laughs> well, nobody not, wants your waist trainer. And you and you will not uh sleep when you die. You will die when you die. Right. <laughs> you be dead. Ain't no sleeping, you dead. I did, did. You still, you you still missing out on sleep. <laughs> <laughs> David, what's up, man? Look, I'm chilling. I'm chilling. I was, I got a little sick yesterday, but I'm recovering now. Got a little cold. Say what? Around. Got a little cold going around in the house. Were you scared to share that? Like, <laughs> like you were nervous, like. Hey, wait, like, you <laughs> look, you said that, Lordy. You said, um, so y'all can't hear me. We, we hear can now, but it we like can, it's and we heard you before that me. answer. <laughs> oh, you was you was Lordy. You was last like, week. Yeah, we were talking about the end of surprise. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that's like, exactly what you did, dude. <laughs> Got a little. Got a little sick last week. <laughs> hey man, but shout out to that boy Dana. And as always, man, long live Big Norm. Long live the big homie. Man, I had hit Dana up, was trying to see what shoes he had, trying to get Mari some sneakers for his little trip he going on next week. Hey, he went to the prom. Now he going. What trip he going on? Oh, uh, you know, like the end of the year. I think they going to. Oh yeah, like Bush Gardens or Universal yeah. Or somewhere. Yeah, I think they going to Universal. I don't know. Hey, I got a question. He was fly. Were those shoes his size? Yeah. Those things look long as crap. They <laughs> were ten, we ten and a half. What? Yeah. Oh yeah. He wear, a ten, he wear a 10 and a half? Amari has a swimmer's body. <laughs> he long and skinny with flippers. <laughs> he wears a 10 and a half? 10 and a half. What's that shoe to Pete wear? Uh, six and a half. Six and a half or a seven. I don't know. 
He was a seven. We was in the shoe store today. They were talking about seven. Uh, Jael West. <laughs> <laughs> And the lady was like, small feet is where it's at. You get all the shoes, and they're cheaper. I'm like, you ain't lying, boy, because this young man here, boy, for your Full birthday, price. for Full your price. birthday, we going for his birthday, we going to um fill out job applications. Uh, <laughs> how old is he? How old is Amari? He'll be 15. Oh shoot. Amari be 15. Yeah, bro. Golly. Yep. That'll yeah, put, that put, that put Pete at what, 13? 13. Dang. Yeah, Pete will be 13 next month. That's crazy that they're all like stair step. Amari's 15, Pete's 13, Judea's 11, and Joe is 9. Wow. <laughs> and Trip would be 7. Oop. Trip, we're gonna be seven. Yep. No, when is his birthday? His birthday in August, right? Yeah. 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 I think it'd be seven. Hey. The girls, will be, the girls will be six. Oh, um, in two weeks. What you doing for their birthday? We're going to Legoland. Y'all love spending. Ooh. Y'all love spending money. <laughs> Hey. Why do you think I work all these hours? How about to say it man work seven days a week? <laughs> Turn hey. up. <laughs> it's, it's, hey, it's cheaper than throwing a party. For real. It, it'd be around the same thing. At the end of the day, once they do everything, yeah, you'd be yeah, around. We, we ain't gotta cook no food, we ain't gotta cook no food for no jits and no, have any... cheaper. Legoland is expensive. Legoland is buy one. Legoland is buy will get one free, and we got access to the Military ticket set prices. Still, that for all all four of y'all, it's gonna run you a couple grand to Legoland. Yeah, ain't it? No, it's in Kissimmee. <laughs> yeah, it's not. Legoland is not. It's not. That's what I'm, uh, I know. Yeah. Like, what is? <laughs> how much does Legoland cost? It's not even hundred dollars a ticket. Oh. Yeah, did you think it was a resort? I thought Legoland was. He thought it was part of like you know the whole. I never. That's why I never took the kids went down to Florida. Nah, yeah, is it when when you be when uh, we be going to the kennel? They be having the sign Legoland. (laughs) Because Universal Studios and Disney World expensive too. Yeah, not with the not not with not with the hookup. What hookup? You never heard of ITT? Yeah, I heard of ITT. Oh, they got some good prices. I ain't never heard of ITT Tech. No, no. It's, <laughs> it's, 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 it's like a tickets it's and a, travels. It's the um military the military discount spot where you can go get tickets for pretty much anything in your area. Mm-hmm. <laughs> ah, okay. At a reduced okay. rate, like real, real reduced, like really cheap. Like a Disney World ticket is like two hundred dollars, you get them for like a hundred. I need to um, go on ITT. Just tell, Daddy, just, tell Daddy, just tell Daddy to go over there. Yeah, and what I about go right over there and sit with him. Yeah, like, hey, you can probably go online. You can probably go online and look up the NAS Jacks. Um, ITT. oh, I I seen you the prices. I got it already. You know, so, I got you know I got the wife on the inside. <laughs> Can she shop over there? Is she a GS or is she a contractor? She a GS. Oh. She a GS what 13? I wish. She ain't no MS 13. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Holmes? Vato. Eastside Loco. <laughs> so what y'all think about the NBA playoffs? Um, it's going how I expected. Me yeah. too. Me too. Yeah. Exactly how I expected. Cause I knew Boston and, and Milwaukee go seven games. 
I think take, I, I, need, I, I needed that to go seven games. Yeah. Speaking yeah. of Boston, I seen this little um, meme. Was that yesterday or today? I don't know. One of these days that I was awake. Um, it said it was like Jason Tatum has looked LeBron, KD, and Giannis in the eyes in the playoffs. Yeah. And they That's showed they were showing like highlights and they banged on LeBron so nasty. Oh yeah, man. I saw that. I saw that one. Oh, I forgot all about that. That was like Tatum is that dude face. Like Tatum, Tatum was working out with um with Kobe before Kobe died, didn't he? Wasn't it? Yeah, he got that Mamba mentality. Tatum and Booker, they were both, they were all they were all working out with Kobe. That's um Jason Tatum is. Is it Larry Hughes? I think Jason Tatum is like Larry Hughes' godson. Like, really? that's Larry Hughes' best friend. That's his son. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. And then um, Larry Hughes was just on Knuckleheads. And he was talking about that. Um, and now his son is, like, coming up playing ball. So is, he was like, you know is how. That, is that – um? Kenya Martin's son on Miami Heat? Taylor Martin? No. His son Kenyon played, Martin Martin played for the Rockets. Oh, okay. His name Kenya Martin Jr. <laughs> <laughs> I think he played for the Rockets. He played for somebody. Yeah. I know who you're in the league. That's Dang crazy. Old. A lot of a lot of juniors. It's a lot of juniors coming around. Yeah, Scotty Pippen's son at, at Vanderbilt balling. Like, can't forget about Gary Payton's son. Yeah, he got Gary Payton's son. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot of juniors starting to starting to come around. But yeah, I expected Miami to do what they did, and yeah. I expected Golden State to do what they did. Yeah. Um. Play is Clay is special, but I think Shoot, Steph, 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 miss, <laughs> Steph miss, 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 right? And then he makes it when it's perfect time to suck away any kind of hope yes. that the other team has yes. to win it. <laughs> it's, either, look, time. it's either he hit a three that puts them up by like 12 yeah, it's like three minutes left, and it's just like, yeah, we're not coming back. Or the other team on the run, he hit a three and put them up by four. Now it's like, yeah, it's just be like, like, come on, bro. But that dog, somebody, I was having a conversation last night, <clears throat> and um, they were saying that um, Golden State almost lost the series, and. And Memphis didn't have that number one score. I'm like, Memphis was better without job this year than they were with him. They had a better record? Yeah, they had a better record without job than they did with job. Memphis is a good team. I'm like, I'm like job, team. all job does is he just takes away the scoring opportunity for everybody from everybody else on the court who's capable of scoring. Nah, cause ja, ja is a but Ja is a point guard that can score. Yeah. So he don't, you know, what I'm saying he don't mind passing. He don't. He don't mind. He doesn't. He doesn't. But if you're putting up 45 points, you're not passing. But that's Ja the thing. has a lot of MJ in him. He has a lot of MJ characteristics. Yeah. Like yeah. But like he has he, that. He has that killer instinct. He has that. That swag, that confidence, that mm-hmm. cockiness. You know what I mean? Like, and he's gonna be gr- a great player. But I'm, what I'm saying is, Memphis didn't really. Memphis didn't need Ja to be. And uh, I don't think Ja Ja being on their team playing, if he would have been hurt, I don't think it would have made any, that much of a difference with him in the series. In the series. Because Memphis has been dogging people all year, like when John was out. John was out like the last, what, four weeks they, of the season. Look, before the playoffs started, if they didn't have John, I'd have said they would have been swept in the first round. With John, would have been like, they're they probably going to lose the series, but they definitely got swept without him. <laughs> and, and ain't nobody, yeah, you need that superstar in the playoffs. 
Yeah, Golden you, State, you Golden State it. was playing yesterday like they don't practice together. <laughs> and they yeah, still for real. For they, real. Were, they were literally playing like they don't practice together. They were playing that like they were playing like all they do oh. in practice is shoot. <laughs> I think I, I shoot regular shots. I think shots. Memphis would have beaten with y'all. What you said, Joe? I think Memphis would have beat them with y'all last night. Because no, they, because I, I don't know, because Looney had all them rebounds. Yeah, but it's because of the way, because of the way Golden State was playing, though. Like that would have been a game that that superstar for the other team would have been able to win for them. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like you have, there's always that one game in the series where your superstar. Literally just wins that game for you, like you know what I'm saying. Like, regardless of what the other team, like with Boston and, and Milwaukee, Tatum, yeah, Tatum, 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 Tatum won, that won that. Like, but at the same though, time, Giannis had 44 points. Tatum that's what I'm. That, that's what I was about to say. He had like 44 and 20, but Jason Tatum was just hitting them shots. You know what I mean? That they was coming back, and then he just get the ball and boom, sit down. I really like Tatum's game. Tatum got Tatum can hoop. Yeah, yeah. I like I like Josh, I like Josh's game too. Though. Give him a few more years in the league, Josh will be virtually unstoppable. If the if the NBA draft was today, who's the first pick? Huh? If like, I mean, if, if the NBA draft like with the, the NBA draft, players. Current NBA players, yeah. I thought you were saying college players. players. I was like, I don't know. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, on 2K, I don't even do the, um, the like, the when I do the draft class, I don't do the college. I just do one of the old school um, draft <laughs> classes. Like, for real, but I might as well do random. I don't know. Nobody coming out, like, well, I know two people, that the tall, the tall dude from oh, dude, yeah, He thought it was Pat Mahomes. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that was so hilarious. That was oh, the reporter chased him down and he yelled his name, Pat. Pat. Did you really think Pat Mahomes was that tall? He thought Pat, he thought I was Pat Mahomes. And the dude turned around and started talking to him like he was Pat Mahomes. Oh, yeah. I, like, embarrassing. I, just, I thought you were someone else. <laughs> no, you could have walked away. <laughs> He said, oh, that's why he didn't answer me when I was calling him. <laughs> <laughs> no, the internet, the internet keeps everything. The internet catches everything. Oh, man. Oh, what boy said, that's why you didn't answer me when I was calling your name. <laughs> but back to the um, draft. Who would be my first pick? Yeah, who who would be the who do you think would be the number one pick? Giannis yeah. or Luca? I think you gotta go Giannis. Yeah, I go Giannis. Even though because Jokic, because you know, Jokic has won two MVPs, I he don't pick. play no defense. Even now, even now, he would be a second a second round player. Round yeah, I, yeah, I don't know when I would pick him. I don't know he where he after, would he would be on my after draft. His two MVP season, he'll be a second round pick. He's like Steve Nash. I think he's worse than I think he worse than Steve Nash. I think so. Like, I think so too because Giannis and Joel Embiid way better play all around players than him. But he's the first player to have what was it two thousand one thousand and five hundred? Yeah. That so he got to be doing something. He, he's like good. First player. Offensively, offensively, he has like I think he broke like the record for P P P R or per a two thousand two thousand points, one thousand rebounds, and five hundred assists. Yeah. yeah. All right. So those first two things, he's seven feet tall. Giannis is too. KD is too. LeBron might as well be. Embiid is too. Yeah, and, and how many how many rebounds? LeBron's top LeBron's top what five in in all three of those all the time, but he's never done that in the season. I'm surprised Westbrook hey, never. Did I was that. just about to say, hell, Westbrook ain't even did it. Like, I still don't think he's. He, I still don't think he deserved to get MVP this season. 
Me either. Nah, they should have gave it to somebody else. <laughs> I don't care who it was. They should have gave it to somebody yeah. else. Not him. <laughs> yeah. Because he, he's so flat foot on defense. He flat foot on offense, too. I don't understand how he do all of that. <laughs> <Me either. laughs> like, yeah. So I th- yeah, I think I think Giannis would be the number one pick because mm-hmm. he's he's like prime, but still getting better. Yeah, still getting better. Even though he can't, I was watching that video, the video I sent y'all, where they said, "Oh, he like he was putting in whatever they said on the video." When he took, like, took seven steps. He was doing ballet dancing around. He did him. a spin move and then took four steps after he did the spin move. That was wild. The only thing worse, <laughs> and everybody was like, oh, that that's an awesome mom. move. The only thing worse than that was Joel and B step back after James Harden got there. When he did the step back, step back. Like he literally <laughs> did the step back from the video when Buddy be traveling. He literally yeah. did yeah. that. But what are you doing? <laughs> or Steph. Why would MB do a step back? Or Steph on the fast break when Steph grabbed the ball. I just forgot to dribble. He was on a fast break and just forgot to dribble. Grab, I had the ball. With two so many of them videos. It's like, like, oh, can't forget Westbrook taking yeah. the ball. Westbrook just got the ball and was holding it. He like, started ball. walking, calling plays. <laughs> right? Do y'all see this? They was like, bro, look at this man. And he was looking like what? <laughs> There's so many of them videos. And they be looking so confused, like they ain't doing nothing wrong. What y'all think LeBron would be picked at? Top 10? Yeah, he'll definitely be top 10. Oh, yeah. He Didn't he leave the league in scoring this year or something? If he would have... <clears throat> finished the season? He would have been a real GOAT and finished the season and got his team in the playoffs. Then he could have led the league in scoring. Man. Yeah, LeBron would be top 10. So would... Um, I think Ja would be top 10. KD. I don't know. He might be. KD, he kind of disappointed. I don't know. Yeah, I don't he, know could, he could score. He could, he could average fifty points a game if he wanted to. And that's the thing. You ever heard? You ever heard? Um, it was like an interview, and they was talking about him scoring. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, why he never scored that many points a game? And he was like. Because I have to shoot too much. Basically, that's what that was his answer. Like, I would have to shoot the ball too many times, and I don't, I don't want to shoot the ball that much. Like, I, I need to get my teammates involved. Type of. I'm like, that's, what? See, that's that's the that's the problem with Katie. Katie, you Katie is like. He should have stayed in Golden most, State. His body is the most like he has the. How can I say it? He has the most unguardable, like, like height and like skill set in the NBA. Yeah. So he should shoot as much as he wants. He should take yeah. thirty shots a game. Like you literally can. He can literally shoot from anywhere on the court and over anyone. Got handles. He can go to the rack, mid range, spot up, off the dribble. Like he should, he should easily lead the league in scoring every year. Yeah. After that, after I saw that interview, I was like, "Okay, I see why. I see why he don't lead the league in scoring. Like, because he, that's why he went to Golden State. He literally, he that that's his type of basketball. If he can just, if he can go average about twenty three, somebody ever else average about twenty three, somebody else average twenty. He'll, he'll be good to go with that. Just, just play system basketball. Yeah, I don't like it. I don't like it. He need that T Mac mentality. Yeah. He need he's he down. need to get on it because he's falling. He's slowly falling down that list of best players in the league. Why can't I find LeBron James on the scoring? Are you looking at the right list? Yeah. Are you looking at playoffs? I'm looking at regular season. Let me go to the actual team. He was second. Yeah. Second behind the feet. 
LeBron James? Yeah, points per game. Mm-hmm. Maybe what did I miss? Did I miss it? Um, okay, so right now, regular seasons per game points in the 2021-2022 season. Why isn't LeBron on the list? If you because we got Joe MB, Joel MB for 33.8, and Giannis entered the combo with 32.9, and then Luca and then Trey. Are you he sure you're not? Points a game? Huh? He averaged 33 points a game this year? You ain't looking at something right. You must be looking at playoffs or something. No, this is the regular season. In the playoffs, Giannis leads in the playoffs with 32.3. Regular season. No, it wasn't 30. No, I was looking at minutes. That was minutes. I'm sorry. <laughs> Just Negroes. Yeah. But at the same time, so they still got Joe Allen B, one, two, and three. LeBron isn't even on this list for some reason. He sure isn't. I wonder why. Did he not qualify because of the number of games? That could be it. <coughs> Dang, LeBron, you messed up people. You messed up your money, man. Yeah. Oh, well. See, Joel B, he was a 49.9% field goal. That's not good for a center. You gotta be y'all gotta be you gotta be over 50 as a big man. Giannis was 55. Jokic was 58. <laughs> and he and he shoot the ball. That's wild. Yeah. Oh yeah, this scoring, this scoring list is yeah. It's it's the usual suspects. Man. You know what team is, is gonna be super sorry? Or well, they sorry now, but they're gonna continue to be sorry. Who? Lakers. Portland. Yeah. Dame better get the hell out of Portland. <laughs> I don't know why he tried to be loyal. I know, right? What is hey, that? They, they got rid of his they got rid of his sidekick. That would have been my That would have been my sign to leave. Well, CJ McCollum probably called Dame like, boy, listen, you better get the hell out of there. <laughs> Man, I'm in New Orleans. Like, I'm in New Orleans. I'm in New Orleans. And we balling. <laughs> I'll be right back. I got to go check on my ribs. You look like a rib. Rib sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Portland, they were sorry this year. Very. It was, it was quite a few sorry teams this year. San Antonio was sorry too. San Antonio, that well, San Antonio. I don't even understand how they, like, they were in the hunt towards the end. Mm-hmm. No, like nobody on that. Team. Nobody. Pop did. Pop <laughs> was trying to work his magic. I think Pop ready to retire. Yeah. He he just don't care no more. He he seemed like he happy. <laughs> Pop chilling, pop chilling at this point. He like whatever, whatever y'all boy, y'all young boys want to do. <laughs> I can't even coach y'all. I can't even coach the way I used to coach. I just gotta, yeah. We just go do what we do. Let's go. Yeah, I, I was surprised. I'm, I was surprised Cleveland was good. Yeah, Cleveland, Cleveland was balling. They had a lot of young players. That boy Kevin Love was still over there hooping. Hey, speaking of Cleveland and LeBron, did y'all that that whole um, debate that of LeBron versus Jordan? That oh um, yeah, on that <laughs> cancel court. Yeah, I didn't see it. I didn't get, I didn't oh, get you gotta watch it. Though. You gotta watch it. He said, you gotta watch it. He said when Jordan left the team, they won. They Jordan was there. They won 50, 55 games. Jordan left. They won fifty two games. When LeBron leaves a team, they turn into a high school team. (laughs) (laughs) Cleveland was so sorry. (laughs) 
I ain't never seen nothing like that. Oh, clearly. <laughs> first and the, the first and the second time he left Cleveland. Yeah. Yeah, then the first time when they left, they drafted Kyrie first pick. Yep. yep. But Kyrie played like what three college games? <laughs> that was wild. Three college games. That was all they needed to see. <laughs> like, hey, he started a trend. <laughs> we don't need to see nothing else, young man. Just get healthy. All we need to know is are you able to play next year? Hey, y'all seen that new um that new on um, switch? Switching it up, y'all seen that new Firestarter movie? I saw it and I stroked scroll past it. I was thinking about <laughs> watching it. I mean, it looks like this this is a remake that I can get down with. I wasn't um, down look, with switching switching lanes again, real quick. I don't know what made me just think about this, but that song that um the Quavo remade Strub the Ground. Why did they say Strub the Ground? What is Strub? What? Who said Strub? Strub the ground. Who said that? Because Poison Clan. Is that Poison Clan? No, that's Black Pack. Black Pack didn't give them permission to say Scrub the ground. They don't have to give them permission. They already they gave them permission to use the beat. If you listen to it, Strub, strub, the, strub ground. the ground. Like, well, <laughs> I was like, they were talking about that. Yeah, like they, they, I, I, I was like, I'm like, did I miss something? Like, I'm like, nobody has ever said strub the ground. Like, what, what is this? <laughs> like, are, are y'all starting something new? Like, what? Yeah, they starting F and F. That's what they get. <laughs> That's what they get for taking a classic and destroying it. Hey. This song's straight, though. Yeah. Might as him saying strub. Speaking of classics, <laughs> did you, did you, that Kodak song, the being, ah. Uh, Oh yeah, the um Usain Bolt. Yeah, that's yeah. all we did. <laughs> so, so Kodak remade the Bing Eye. Oh uh-huh. yeah. yeah. You seen Kodak? You seen Kodak's DJ? Uh-uh. So y'all seen um that DJ that Tyree had posted on his page, the like real pretty DJ girl. No, so, don't make me laugh. He had posted on his story, but she's um Kodak. Kodak Black's DJ. Oh, okay. Speaking of Kodak Black, <laughs> he's featured on Kendrick Lamar's album. Oh yeah. He has a he's a he's like a big part of the album. And that album is good. I haven't listened to it. I haven't listened to it. It's 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 up there. Is it? Yeah, yeah. it's up there. I, I, I've seen nothing but good. If you like Co- if you like Kendrick Lamar, it's up there. I, I do Kendrick, like Kendrick. I like I Kendrick like Kendrick Lamar's Lamar last album. Kendrick Lamar and Nas <laughs> is the same person to me. I me, I can't I I just can't get into it. Now I, I see why everybody be hyped about him. Like I, I see I, I I see, but it's a no for me, dog. It's no for <laughs> well, me. Dog. Yeah, yeah. You, you gotta listen to it. Just gotta I can't get into J. Cole. Cause it's giving me, you can't do what? <laughs> like I listen to J Cole album, I'm like, all right, yeah, he's saying a lot of stuff. I ain't never heard nobody say that before. That's a new one. Hey, dude, so, <laughs> you can't do what he set up with. You can't do you what said J Cole. Nah, I'm, I'm, I'm back up off of that one. I mean, I, I like Cole. I like I. I with Ken, I don't know if it's Kendrick voice or his cadence. That I just can't. I, I don't know. Cadence. It might like is it, it might be his voice because sometimes he be having that very very high pitched voice. But yeah. I would I would tell you this album reminds me a lot of the Love Below. If you mm. like Love Below, I, Kendrick, this album is is it's along that line of so vibing music. I give I'm gonna give it another try. I had to, me and the boys was riding the day and we was listening to it. And it was like, what is this? <laughs> <laughs> what is this? But yeah, I, I seen um I seen that they it was like a lot of Kodak in it, like the intro. Yeah. He doing Kodak the intro, intro, and he got yeah. A, yeah. The, the song I, I forgot the name of the song I listened to that he was on. It was jamming though. That song was jamming. He he I got like, a couple like songs Kodak. that be jamming. He got one with Ghostface Killer. Yeah. Purple Hearts. That shit fire. 
Yeah, I see. I seen. Um, you know, everybody was kind of hyped about Kendrick. Kendrick dropping. I usually don't listen to whole albums. Like, I'll probably listen to it and be like, "Oh, this song, I'm tired of this," and turn it off. But I listen to the whole one, finish to end. I mean, beginning to end. So, get thumb two thumbs up. I look. I give them this. I give them in the comments. If y'all listen to that, Kendrick, um, put it in the comments what you think about it. I need you to send me that video. That we're gonna make a video. Have it. <laughs> that video is lost. In the, lost. It's lost, lost somewhere. Lost in the sauce. <laughs> I ain't seen someone, it. Someone has it somewhere. I think Tori still it. has it. She might have it, but I don't got I, it. I texted Tori like, "Hey, Tori, I need. To, we're gonna make a video." And her reply was, "No." <laughs> <laughs> so that means she has it. That means she has it. <laughs> that definitely means she has it because I've never had. It. <laughs> Nope. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> That's funny. So have y'all had a chance to see Doctor Strange yet? No, there's I don't have time. I got kids I, I don't um, want to take places because they don't I accidentally don't know how to act, act in public. <laughs> Join the club. Join the club. <laughs> I can't take my kids to the store. <laughs> I can't take them to the grocery store. I'm so glad. I, I'm so glad they they can stay home by themselves now. Too. <laughs> <laughs> what do they be doing? It's not. It's it's not you, Dave. It's the boy. <laughs> it's the boy. <laughs> he gets in public. He gets in public, and then he acts like he can't stop talking, <laughs> talking like constantly talking loud, <laughs> moving around, touching stuff. Danny, can I get no? I've already gave you this speech. Don't ask for nothing. <laughs> you, gotta get, you gotta get that speech before y'all get out of the car. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Go in the movies. Everybody in the movies watching the movie. Just like, Danny, like, what, what is he doing? <laughs> I'm like, Joe. He too hey, old to be doing that. Joe, be quiet. Watch the movie. Stop asking questions. I don't know. I'm watching this movie for the first time just like you are. <laughs> <laughs> My kids yeah. still ain't missing movies yet. <laughs> no, dude. As much as y'all look, as much as you be at the movies. I'll take them <laughs> if you <it made> joy. <laughs> we go see movies that are not suitable for five-year-olds. Hey, my dog Diz is definitely um, one of the people keeping movie theaters open. My dog will slide to the movies on you, man. Oh, like, definitely. I definitely go to the movies. He'll slide real quick. But it's only Marvel movies. I only go see Marvel movies. <laughs> but I ain't taking the kids. <laughs> I ain't taking them. Nope. Any other movie I watch on TV, but Marvel. Hey, movie, hey that movie with Sandra Bullock and um, Shannon Tatum. I saw that. That movie is pretty funny. I saw that in previews. I was like, this look crazy. I watched it on the plane. That movie was pretty funny. What's the name of it? Um it's on um, is it on it's on Peacock or Paramount Plus? That's, yeah, that's why I asked because I was I was on Paramount earlier and I saw I saw the little I thought I think that's the movie y'all talking about. Yeah, yeah, that's on Paramount Plus. Oh, okay. Okay. Karen Tatum is an f- idiot in that movie. Oh, you know a movie I just watched that came out? What? On HBO Max? Old. That movie's crazy, ain't it? Yeah, that movie was out there. And hey. Night Shyamalan is crazy. He got Look, issues. I don't know. That, that made me, that made me kind of give him like Shyamalan. It didn't just come out, but they just released it on HBO Max. It's when they get on the, when they, when they're on the island. And they start eating and real Every fast. minute is like a day. Yeah. 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 Okay, yeah. And they can't like the kids. The kids just boom was like teenagers or something like that. Yeah. They were looking like what the. Like, like in thirty minutes, just thirty minutes, the kid went from being a a kid to get pregnant. Yeah, yeah, to being pregnant. Yeah, yeah. I that was wild. That 
I, I definitely saw that. I thought you had to do it a couple, only a couple of times again. <laughs> <laughs> I would never be a nasty. <laughs> she done got pregnant and I had the baby. Yeah. She got pregnant and I had the baby and the baby died all in 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that movie was crazy. But he kind of made up for it because I hadn't been an M. Night Shyamalan fan. It was a good movie. It was a real, it since, was good. Since The Village. <laughs> he did, did Mr. Glass too, didn't he? Yeah, he did Mr. Glass and Unbreakable. He did all three of them. Yeah, those um, were good. But those, those endings, that ending made me mad too. Mr. Glass ending. But it was it was an ending that went towards to the last one. What's it called? The Beast? Or what was that? The last one was called Mr. Glass. No, it wasn't Mr. Mist- it was know? Unbreakable, Split, and then Mr. Glass. No, Split was the last one. No, Split came out between Unbreakable and Mr. Glass. No, it didn't. Split came out. Mr. Glass came out way before Split. No, Mr. Glass was the final movie because they all died in that movie. This Split came out after Mr. Glass. No. They all died in Mr. Glass, did you? How is Split going to come out after that? Mr. Glass came out in 2019. Split came out in 2016. <laughs> All right. It didn't make sense. Hey, I remember, look, I remember trying to watch Split on um, on Fire Stick. And like, cause you know, you got to go to the little link. Yeah. First one I went to, I'm like, oh, it's clear. That joint came up, boom, loaded up real quick. Ain't even spinning or nothing. I'm talking about crystal clear. I, oh, I'm at the movie theater. Kick back. Nigga was in the bowling alley. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> this what? This ain't the right movie. Like they really, really rode like rode the split. Like for real. I'm like, come on, man. Come on. Get out of here. <laughs> That's like me trying to watch Doctor Strange on the fire stick. <laughs> and it was a clear copy of Incredibles. <laughs> hey, they be hey, they be getting you. They be getting you. I don't it's know. always a clear copy of just some random. It's one movie on the Fire Stick that it seemed like the last five movies I tried to watch, they all went to this movie, and every copy was clear, 4K, like the way the movie started off. It just looked so raw. It was like water. So it was like. Just looks so nice. I have no idea what that movie is. Like, I was like, man, I need to just watch this just because of how clear it is. But I can't watch nothing on my fire accidentally reset the fire stick. I don't know how. Like, so when I go to it, they say, Would you like to set up the fire stick in English? <laughs> oh like, man. So it's totally like factory reset. Yes, yes. Dang. Like, log into your Amazon account all the way to that. Oh, wow. Yeah. See, this is why I stopped with the fire stick. It was making me mad. It was pissing me <laughs> off. I said, I'm just going to... It don't even take that long to download the two the two apps that we had that I got the movies and all the channels on, but I just don't want to, like, when I, when I go to it and see that, I just get mad all over again. And just <laughs> Who reset it? <laughs> I did. I don't know how. Like, I was literally watching watching the, a movie or something on there. Next thing you know, I was, on, I was looking at my phone. I don't know if I got sucked into like the TikTok wormhole or something, and like <laughs> sat on the remote. And I looked up, and it was like, it was like, uh, well, it was. I forgot if it was like saying like resetting or something like that, and it was just like. Counting down or something, and I'm like, like to, no. look, I'm pressing the button on the remote. No. I'm like, <laughs> cancel, cancel, turn it off. Cancel. That TikTok wormhole is a real thing, man. It hasn't got me yet. Or just said Joy yeah. has the video. Hmm. Or just said Joy has the video. Who has it? Joy. <laughs> How does she get it? I don't know. But <laughs> I need it. I need it to edit in, edit it into this episode. All right, I see if I can get it from him. Okay. 
Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna make it happen. <laughs> We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Y'all boys crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh mm-hmm. yeah, but I'm gonna get release another spoiler for um, a real spoiler for Doctor Strange. Mm-hmm. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. Professor X is in it. Is it the, the, the real? The real Professor X. What's the real? Like, like which one? The one from the original X Men movies. The and old, the, and the, the old floating in the floating yellow in the floating the, yellow wheelchair. The Star, the Star <laughs> Trek dude. Yes. Uh, the original uh, Professor X. The original Professor X is in it, and the dude from um, Fantastic Four is in it, right? Yeah, um, Mr. Fantastic, the Stretch yeah. Man. Yeah, but it's a new a new guy playing him. Oh, boo! The, the guy from um, The Quiet Place. The daddy. Jim? Yeah, Jim is playing Doctor Strange. Jim. He all, Jim go, from, he, from he all bearded up. Yeah, he all bearded up. Jim from who? The Office. The office. Oh, I didn't watch The Office. Yeah. You never watched, I watched The Office? No, I watched The Quiet Place, but I, I can't remember who his daddy was. Oh, you should watch yeah. The Office. The Office is uh... The Office is hilarious. The is. Office is one. Of, the Office is like Abbott Elementary. Yes. But yeah, I, I've seen like I've seen like uh, clip, funny, clip. Yeah. I never just got it Steve into Carell, it. Steve Carell is an idiot. That he is. <laughs> that he is. Forty-year-old right. virgin. Him, him as Michael. Man, forty-year-old virgin was that movie was so funny. <laughs> yeah. Kelly Clarkson. <laughs> Have you seen him in what's that movie called? Um, where he's he's kind of slow, and he's friends with um Ant Man, the guy that played Ant Man. Oh, I haven't seen that. What is it called? I can't remember what it's called, but he is that movie is hilarious. He's he's an idiot. Yeah, he is. I he haven't is. seen no I haven't seen no new movies. Yeah, Doctor Strange was good. And Scarlet Witch, she is she would the only whip. person that she she will have a hard time beating would be Phoenix. Nope. You think she'll she'll destroy Phoenix? She she broke Professor X's neck in his mind. <laughs> <laughs> Why did she break Professor X's neck? Well, hold on, hold on. But Professor X, like he's already he got greasy. His, he got greasy in his mind before. Um, um, which oh, which uh, was that? yeah, but that yeah. was before he got older. You know, the older you get, the stronger you get at the music. Yeah, true. True. He was trying to free like her alter ego um, that had got trapped and she turned out there. <laughs> he was trying to free Wanda. Yeah, and Professor X was in the real life like <laughs> 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 I was like so all of y'all whole Illuminati got greased by Wanda by Scarlet Witch. Hey, you see what she did to people who was trying to take vision away from her? She should. I hate vision is another one. Vision is so trash. Vision, vision is so trash. He, they made him so soft. They made him softer than Hulk. Yeah, he was so trash, bro. Like vision, how you not see that coming? Like really? Like come on, come on, come on, guy. He was just trash, buddy. Yeah, vision is trash. If you want to see how Vision should have been, you got to watch What If, that cartoon series. Mm-hmm. That's how Vision would have should have been. Man, I just knew he was going to be that deal. That boy. He should have been. In the comics, he was. Is that Johnny Manziel? In that football league? In you know, that you know, U.S. Oh, no. United that's fan a club league. football? Yeah. One, yeah that T.O., one that T.O. was playing in? Yo, this dude, I don't know what this who this dude is on this one team. He had like, but he had three receiving touchdowns, three rushing touchdowns. Mm. 
he was going up, but his team pretty trash. Oh, and, and greased. Before we wrap up, I got y'all have to, y'all have to sign up for Kev on Stage Studios, the app. I did, but it was too expensive, and I wasn't using it. It didn't, it didn't really appeal to me. It's like like I, I, signed, I signed up for it, and it wasn't. No, mine wasn't five dollars. It was five dollars for like the first six months, and then jump okay, up Kevin on stage. Yeah, yeah mine is four ninety nine a month. I'm signed back up for, it, but why? But, What's on there? But it his shows. It's a show called um, a workplace comedy. Uh huh. You gotta watch it. You have to watch it. I'm a Kevin on stage fan. It's our it's our kind of comedy. You have to watch it. He got Avion Crockett on one episode, and Spice Adams on another episode. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, he that's a good that's a good. I like his shows. I watched um the new episode of Atlanta. I ain't watched it yet. Hey, uh, when, um, Kevin Samuels on there. Kevin Samuels. <laughs> that was, what? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, hey, that was kind of crazy. It was that it was a crazy what episode. A coincidence. It was a crazy episode, but it kind of the episode, just like all of the episodes, eventually they kind of make sense. That last episode, what was that about? Oh, I don't know. Honestly, the last episode he was, <laughs> we had got high had met that that one girl. Was he just was did he hide that was his mom on that? Was she was was that his mom? Was that like I she like so. a, a representation of his mama or something? I think so. Been. Because he woke up in his own bed. Yeah, and he was like, where's so-and-so? He was like, your mom? Huh? Like, <laughs> yeah. Like, your mom? <laughs> that, yeah, that was weird. Yeah, that was that weird. One. <clears throat> the, the, all of these episodes are weird. Like, hey, this like, episode was... Hey, he came in there and he was like, look, <laughs> I'm the heir to the pink oil moisturizer family. And as yeah. an alumni of this high school, I'm donating $8 million to the school. And I'm changing the name. And I'm paying for all you seniors college tuition. <laughs> and everybody was cheering and they were like, if you're black. If you're black. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, when he said that, bro, that was so funny when he said <laughs> that. And then you got people in the hallway auditioning, like, like, hey, this one Indian dude, like, hey, wave check me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I, Dedrick, I was so confused when when he was like, um, I'm going to see the council or whatever. And then they pan to the hallway, and them dudes over there singing the song like they like yeah. one, two, three, and they start singing. I'm like, <laughs> like what is going on right now? <laughs> when they singing "Boys to Men," no, no, they were singing yeah. "Shot." And yeah, yeah, fine. <laughs> so, yes. so oh, was yeah. any of the main characters in this episode, or was it like a? Another none of the main of characters were in this episode. Oh, it was another one of them episodes. Yeah. And he, um, one of the, like, one of the questions was, um, what was one of the black black questions he asked him? <laughs> he asked him, dang, what, what, what are they asking him? Um. They were asking him, like, some random questions, because he was a, he was a mixed <laughs> dude. He was a mixed, he was black and white, but he looked more white than black, straight he hair and everything. Straight white. <laughs> His daddy was so black. <laughs> His daddy was like, His daddy was you and all your white so friends. Black. Hey, don't forget, I know where you get that big nose from. <laughs> <laughs> His daddy was so black. He was like, Did you look at the fast before? I told you, hey, I'm, I ain't feeling that. Out. I ain't feeling that. Out. <laughs> like, I ain't, nope, I ain't doing it. Like, like, yeah, like I told you to say, what did they ask him? Like, how much did you say? 
about four thousand dollars. Like, oh man, son, <laughs> <laughs> you almost had it. <laughs> <laughs> no, he said, wait, wait, he said. Tuition is like fifty thousand dollars. It's like, oh no, nah, you ain't going to that school. <laughs> Messed up. Hey, what did they ask him? I cannot think what they. I cannot mm-hmm. think any of the questions that they. I asked know they him. said like that. That young boy that got killed in the Lincoln Square Mall parking lot by the cops. And then he was supposed to answer. He answered like, "Yeah, I saw that." Like his dad was with him. Like, no, that's not the question. The young boy that was killed in the Lennox Mall parking lot in his car by the cops, your response should have been, mm mm mm. Like, that's a shame. Yeah, I would have felt that. <laughs> and then the answers that he was giving out when they were just showing him answers. Oh, yeah. He like, 227. <laughs> hey, buddy, buddy snapped on him. Hey, buddy snapped on him. Yeah. I knew you weren't black when you walked in here. <laughs> See, See, he called him. He called him red bone. Like you, red bone. <laughs> watch this. As I get off of this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That was that was that was that was funny. Oh, yeah. fellas. Yep. Another episode down. Another episode down. Another week closer to that hundredth episode. You know what I mean? But um appreciate y'all. This nigga did disappear. <laughs> this nigga a magician. <laughs> 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 Patrick Copperfield. <laughs> but yeah, man, another another week down, another episode. Shout out to the lookers, man. Appreciate y'all watching the episode. Hey man, once again, hey, shout out to Brian at the job. I keep forgetting to ask him his name. But dog be dog be watching, dog be watching episodes though. Like he be watching episodes. In the comments, put your name in the comments if you watch yeah. it. I think he I think he commented on the last video. When they yeah. said, yo, yeah, yeah, I think that's who commented on the last video. <laughs> All right, bro, man. You know what I mean? Appreciate you, homie. Um, shout out to the rest of the lookers, man. We see y'all a lot there. Appreciate y'all looking, doing what y'all are doing, keeping them numbers moving. Um, yeah. TikTok. Finally made a TikTok. So um, yeah, we put Dedrick uh, random video on TikTok. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, I make sure y'all. Gonna, I don't think that's gonna get us. Too. You never know. You, you never. So you gotta be, you gotta be doing a TikTok trend in your um, you like podcast shirt, one of them trending things. Yeah, you gotta do one of the dances. Try to find the dance. Yeah, there you go. That one. Do that one. <laughs> That's the one he gonna do. But yeah, man, y'all know everything. Facebook, YouTube, IG, TikTok. You look like a podcast. Y'all know what it is, man. Hashtag YLLAP. Hashtag long live norm. Shout out to the team. Fellas, shout out to y'all families, man. Shout out to the wives, the kids. Shout out to the whole family. Shout out to everybody. Shout out to everybody. Yep. He gritty. Y'all see this? <laughs> hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Man, make sure y'all tune in. Like, share, subscribe. Make sure you got that bell click. Boom. Make sure you get all the episodes when we drop them. You feel me? Oh, you was pressing oh, the bell. Yeah, oh. right. bing, 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 oh. bing. Were you binging or bing eye? Which bing eye. <laughs> what did this got going on? I tried to do that the other day too. Hands look big. Like, my knees don't work. Digit, yeah, digit. You go, you gonna learn. You gonna learn. What? You gonna learn? Keep it up. You gonna learn. You're old, I tried bro. Find a video to show the kids how you take the last party. I can't find it. Nation Facebook. I 
but no, I couldn't find it on Facebook. I didn't, or I didn't feel like going all the way back three years. Yeah, that's a lot of looking through videos. But yeah, you like a podcast. Yo.